Meet the negativity gnoll, the maritime mascot of all things gloomy. Picture this, a sea creature with an overgrown tooth, floating alone in the cold Arctic Ocean, projecting an aura of despair that make even the happiest clown sob into his oversized shoes. This beast isn't satisfied with a half-empty glass. They'd much prefer it shattered on the floor. For them, every silver lining has a cloud, every rainbow is just a sign of rain, and every cupcake is just a ticking time bomb of cavities. They are like a reverse fortune teller, predicting nothing but doom and gloom. In the mind of a negativity gnoll, bad news is around every corner, and this fixation often stems from fear, anxiety, or an unhealthy focus on self-preservation. On the flip side, consider the optimistic otter. This cheerful critter is constantly frolicking, tumbling, and sliding into life's challenges with a sparkling, positive attitude. They see the world as an endless playground, a sandbox full of potential castles. They are like a seasoned surfer, riding life's waves with a grin that says, I've got this. The optimistic otter is to negativity knoll what a playful puppy is to a grumpy garden gnome. They radiate positivity like a sunflower facing the sun, brightening everyone's day with their infectious enthusiasm. Witnessing the negativity knoll in their natural habitat can be as disheartening as finding a squashed frog in your shoe. Yet, as an empathetic eagle, you might swoop down and say, I see you're worried about what might go wrong. What if we also consider what could go right? So, let's dive out of our icy knoll negativity and into the warm, sunny waters of otter optimism, where even the biggest wave is just another fun slide down the river of life. Because who wouldn't want to surf life's challenges with the grace and glee of an optimistic otter? Oh, <laughs> <laughs>